Contrary to popular belief, the new exotic trace rifle in Season of the Deep can absolutely do bits and it really is more than a bog standard support weapon so it's time for the Navigator build in 3 minutes or less. If you lean into its full potential it can hang with the best of them and that's not just from the grapple points you'll generate from completing the exotic car list within the Ghosts of the Deep dungeon. As far as trace rifles go, it'll dish out the pain where you need it to and thanks to the seasonal artifact it'll also deal with them pesky overload champions. Protective Weave is the awesome exotic perk on this strand trace rifle and although giving you and allies woven mail doesn't seem like much on paper, it's actually the whole jumping off point for this end game ready build. Woven mail grants you a huge 60% damage reduction for 10 seconds and stacks on top of your armor resistant mods and even resilience stat too, basically turning you into the incredible Hulk. Woven mail then will always grant your strand weapons unraveling rounds thanks to the strand soldier mod which in turn will cause 10% more damage with improved unraveling. Raveling. But then this gets even crazier, all because of the weft cutter exotic trait, whereby dealing sustained damage to target severs them. Now sever is kind of underrated as it doesn't seem like the debuff does anything drastic, but thanks to this new exotic it actually does. A severed target has a huge 33% reduction in its damage output, essentially negating any surges in endgame activities, then on top of the woven mail that you've already activated, it basically puts you in a strand style well of radiance. This is because as the weft cutter severs targets, it also reprocs woven mail. Now whether this is an unwritten feature or not, it is a thing right now and so constant damage with the navigator proxies over and over again. This also gives you basically unlimited uptime on unraveling rounds and all you then really need is a 22% damage boost from a bunch of strand weapon surge mods which will boost your strand heavy weapon of choice too. Then with both the sever and unravel debuffs applied to that target, you can make this last 50% longer by default from the thread of continuity. This means you can spread your strand around to multiple targets to inflict both of these debuffs and it'll do bits in endgame to all manner of enemies including every single type of champion. Cenotaph Helm is only going to improve on this even more with its love child combo of auto loading holster and reconstruction consistently churn out this boosted strand damage not to mention free heavy on top for allies too. As you'll be causing so much damage you can rapidly recharge your grenade of choice through the thread of generation which can definitely come in handy with the grapple however weaver's trance with the shackle grenade allows you to pop the third and final strand debuff into the mix with near on infinite suspend. As an added bonus the thread of warding will also grant woven mail from collecting orbs of power created through harmonic siphon and if all of this wasn't enough the thread of binding adds that suspended burst to your needle storm super. Everything is unraveled out of its mind and pretty much anything you touch will turn into a tangle so why not chuck in the new wanderer aspect as well. See I told you the new exotic trace rifle was more f***ing nuts than you thought it was so now now you'll need the best exotic weapon to allow you to farm for it in the new dungeon, find out why it's not what you think by watching this next video.